Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? It's JG. Hey listen, this is a an invitation slash challenge to the roboticists, to the, ro the folks at um, Boston Dynamics and Carnegie Mellon University, CMU, where I'm from, and the Berg, Pittsburgh, PA, um, and other folks working on robotics. And not just humanoid robotics, but primarily so. But he here's the thing. We've got this school shooting national situation, right? And knowing what we know about machine vision and the speed of machine vision exceeding human vision a while ago, and what Boston Dynamics is doing right now, what they're doing with their humanoid stuff, their dog stuff, the speed, combining human vision with the facility of the speed of the dexterity, and other companies as well, but the dexterity with the the hands and the dexterity with um, handling things and the speed. So machine vision combined with that speed. And then soft robotics, okay? So they're working on robotics to, to work with the elderly, to not injure them, so it's soft robotics. So here's the thing, this is an X challenge or whatever. Why can't we get these companies, one company or more, organization, university, some entity, to create a humanoid robot or, or dog robot, whatever, spider robot, whatever it is, to, to disarm a shooter in a school shooting situation so that machine vision can identify a gun, a weapon, and rapidly disarm the shooter. Not blow them up, but I'm talking about non-lethal force. So you have soft robotics, so there's no liability, there's no death. We're talking about even swarm technology. So you have swarm technology too that could contain a shooter rapidly and non-lethally. So you can combine, I'm calling on all the roboticists to help our kids. This is for real. I'm calling on all the roboticists to stop school shootings. So we're talking about technology, that what tech can do, what the promise of robotics, besides taking away people's jobs or whatever. How about we save the kids in our schools? Okay, a non-lethal solution with machine vision can rapidly identify the shooter and converge with a soft robot to wrap up. So in other words, it could be like a spider web, <laughs> seriously though, um, or a humanoid in a robot or dog, humanoid, whatever these types of creatures or how many limbs they have, multiple limbs, that's the beauty of it. You could have more than, you know, four arms or five arms. Uh, they already have this technology. Identify the shooter with a gun, wrap them up, and take them down without killing them. So it's a non-lethal solution that disarms them. And you can't kill a robot. So the, the, even if the, they fired off a round, so what? You disarm the shooter before anybody gets hurt. And you could even tap into the school's um, surveillance system as well. Surveillance can identify initially somebody, send a signal to the robots, or you could have however many you need to have in certain strategic locations. And yes, everything could be hacked maybe, but again, if you make it by design non-lethal, the thing is incapable of strangling or killing its soft robotics, it cannot kill a human, but it will disarm the human and wrap them up until authorities arrive. I know this can be done. So this is a challenge. I don't get anything out of it. But this is my invitation and challenge to Boston Dynamics, to CMU, to all the robotics makers. As an XPRIZE, I don't have an X billions of dollars, millions for X prize money, but make it and you can make, you can sell it. But just, that's a solution. So let me know what, uh, what you come up with. Thanks.